Renergy 50 amp DC DC charger with MPPT. The problem in a four wheel drive with this setup is that it prioritizes the solar. So therefore, even if I've only got, which I have, a 100 watt solar panel, it therefore limits the alternator input whilst driving to 25 amps. However, if I disconnect the solar, I can have up to 50 amps coming from my alternator. The priority of the solar is an issue when you only have small solar panels. If I had 600 watt of solar up on the roof, it would be a different thing. So for a motorhome, probably perfect. But for a four wheel drive that runs only a small permanent solar panel and runs additional solar panels, blankets, whatnot, when I get into camp, I need the priority to be the alternator, not the solar. So if I was doing this again for my four wheel drive, I would in actual fact have a separate MPPT controller dedicated to solar, and I would have just a straight 50 amp battery charger from Renergy or whoever to concentrate solely on that, and then I'd even have more power going into the battery, wouldn't I, from both sources. But in this case, I've prioritized the alternator by as soon as I start the car, the solar is disconnected through this relay, so only the charge from the alternator comes through. Just my brief thoughts on the Renergy 50 amp MPPT. Uh, another issue with it, I need, and it's been picked up by another fellow on uh, YouTube here, I need to have an uh, auxiliary wire or ignition wire attached. It, I've got a dumb alternator, but the system still would not charge. I was struggling to get five to eight amps out of it at best. And uh, I needed to set up that ignition wire as though I've got a smart alternator. So that was the first thing. Once I dealt with that, I was pretty happy. But then attached solar, and then I plummeted back to 25 amps and below from the alternator. So my setup now is it prioritizes the alternator when driving, disconnects the solar, and when I get into camp, back on comes the solar, and then I can add through various ports around the car, and to some plugs, I can add one or two other solar blankets or the like. Hope this has been helpful to you guys.